At 1000 hours on December 8th, the Liaowayu 25048, a fishing boat operating in the Bohai Sea, was struck by a large ship and capsized. The captain, Zhang Long, who had been on the bridge, was thrown with great force into the sea. Luckily, he was rescued by a passing boat. The nine other crew members, however, were missing. Through the boat's hull, sounds could be heard to indicate an unknown number of crew was still alive. It was a most serious situation. Rescue vessels Beihaijo 169 and Beihaijo 111, carrying an emergency ready team and equipment, were ordered to sail from Yentai post haste. Divers' attempts to bring out the survivors failed because the cabin door was blocked. The specially trained commander immediately called an alternate plan of action. Two rescue tugs maneuvered into position, securing the fishing boat between them with three cables. Then holes were to be cut in the bottom of the boat. To speed things up, two chainsaw operators worked side by side, determining the positions of the holes, and two doctors were urgently transferred to the scene from Penlai Airfield. As soon as preparation was complete, the two chainsaws were started and all eyes fixed on the rolling saw blades. In order to slow down the outflow of internal air, saw operators did not cut fully through the ship's plate, but left it partially connected. Then two rescuers with hammers smashed the 1,600 square centimeter holes. The first survivor was pulled through, followed by a second, then a third, and then a fourth, until all were rescued. 